Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Spelletons. I'm Zinker. He's Derek. Um, so, Derek, what is your least favorite Pokemon type? <laughs> Sandstar is fucking funny. Oh, yeah. Your person. It probably like probably either psychic or fighting. Psychic or fighting? What are those? Yeah. Well, there's just nothing there's not really anything there's not much in those types that like interests me. And like for what um like I can't really the I can't really think of anything that's like primarily fighting that like interests me. Uh um I, um, I I just don't use most of those types or most of that type specifically. Also, I don't know um, if I've used the psychic, fighting type. Well, I have, but I don't know if like, I use the like, like, like consistent one. There's like one or two things in psychic that I like, but like not a lot. I water I water is what like, does it to me because a lot of them are just fish, and a lot of the fish don't interest me. Yeah, uh, I was interested by wishy washy, but overall disappointed by how its ability worked. I, uh, no, it wasn't that. I just had other stuff I wanted. I I should say it's not so much water type Pokemon that disappoint me. Like uh, Aquanin is freaking rad. I love the bog 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 bug water typing. Um. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, yeah. Aquanid. Or uh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. This is say it. Aquanid. Arachnid, but it's sure. it's arachnid, but it they put aqua there instead. Mm. Sure. Oh, okay. Oh, husk pup. Dude, does he just give me a freaking husky? Oh, that would be rad, actually. I'm not gonna use it, but I, I think it's just cool. Okay. Thanks for the money. Here's, here's a pupper. Yeah, I, well, dude. First off, what a weird location to get a husky. But second off, no, actually, that's it. I just, yeah. <laughs> what? Why in the de Normally in an Arctic desert, not in a desert desert. Isn't it weird how there can be snow deserts? I guess. Have you not noticed that? Oh, there's Arctic. Well, I mean, did you not know that? There's Arctic deserts, you know? Snow deserts. What does that mean? Arctic deserts? It's exactly what it sounds like. Yeah. Uh, you know, like, if you go to Antarctica and you see snow everywhere, that is a desert. I guess. No, it is, by what. I that. Guess. That's how it that's works. Um. I guess I, I guess I should represent uh, Connecticut well here. It's not really you know what? Honestly, I actually hope there is a. I hope there is a Husky Pokemon in the new gen coming up, just because that'd be cool. Oh, it's Ice type. Oh, that's cool. And I got it in Big House for. My favorite. <laughs> God, I love that Disney movie. Dude, it has Moxie. Oh, this is cool. Big House 4? You mean Smart House? No, I meant Big Hero 6, but... What are you talking about, Derek? It was a joke. Wouldn't that be like... House Hero 4 or something? You said Big House 4. Yeah. Hero's the important part yeah, of it, Derek. You know what? You you ruined it. You, you're also wrong, but like you you ruined it. I didn't not, ruin anything. It, it, it's just not worth it at this point. Derek, I can't be wrong. It's been determined by me, and I can't be wrong. So you know. The logic checks out. It's too strong. <laughs> well, I determined that I can't be wrong. Uh, well, I you're just, wrong. I determined that you're wrong. 
Too late. Therefore, I beat you. you. No, you will. I already said you're wrong. I beat you well, that's in the recording. I, have, I'm on a delay. I know you I'm are, listening. but I beat you in the recording. So as far as anyone else is concerned, I have just won every argument. Oh my god, every argument has just been settled for life. Oh, we gotta go no. find him in a cave. I don't know where Goldoon Desert is. Classic. The classic example what's of... Gym, what's with gym leaders and having to be found in caves? I don't even have a map. Why don't they give you a freaking map? Where the fuck do I go? I thought they gave me a map. Is it in the pokey here? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Um, Goldoon Desert. Is Goldoon... Nope, that's Fall Rock Valley. I'm excited for that area. Oh my god, Burt's Balls. My favorite. <laughs> Can't wait to... Alright, we gotta go find a cave down down in Gold Dune Desert. So, here we go. It's looking for Pokemon fossils. Oh, shit. We're finding a Pokemon. It's a Gorm. Gorm, more like... Snorm. More like Norm, the genie. I wonder, what, I wonder what percentage of Pokemon we've seen so far. You think there's a genie Pokemon? There's, uh, I don't know if there is. There's, I've, uh, I, I don't know if I told you, there's, uh, around 360 total Pokemon, something like that. It, it's past 350, under 400. Or was it 450? Okay. Wait, hold on. I thought, I thought we... Not close to 450. I, I it might be 450. I, I might I might have the first number for. Oh my God! Go faster. Go faster. This is this is killing me. Okay, I don't know. Uh, I I think I think it, it, it it's either 350 or 450 around those numbers, and like some change. Um, but I did look up the number. There is a lot of options in this. And that's why it's so cool. And also why I'm having this dilemma if I want to catch everything. Too many options in this case. Too many options. Um, what I'd like... But, it, I mean, this is how I want Pokemon games to be. Like, I like not necessarily 400, but, like, these are all new Pokemon. And that's cool. I hate seeing the same old, same old. And it's so refreshing it, po Pokemon needs, like, a change-up, and I feel like the only thing they need to do to have a proper change-up is to just actually stick with all-new Pokemon, because it would feel like a new experience. It's always a new experience that way. Yeah. I'm tired of fighting fucking Pikachus, man. Sure. In every fucking game. I'm sure everyone is. But it's, you know, it's what, yeah. they, it's what they rely on, and I, I don't know why they do that. I think I think that's weird. Uh, it it's probably uh, someone said it's because the reception to Gen Five was like bad, and I'm like, because people hated the designs, and I'm like, and that's why people fucking suck, you know? Because and, and then everyone's like, oh, Pokemon's so stale. I'm like, it's we we all we all want the fucking like gym experience and stuff like that, right? Well, people are always going to complain no matter what. I think they're well, just trying to do what what feels safest to them. Who? Oh, like, Game Freak? Because, like... It, but that, that that's what I think is going to kill the series off. Because, uh, eventually... Um, which, I mean, I don't think it'll ever actually die. But it will... It, it dwindles the fan base when every... Like, it's the same thing every time. They, they have to change it up to eventually. But, uh, it's not that it needs to, like, be an entirely different game... Like, Breath of the Wild or Mario Odyssey is for a lot of its other ones. I'm very fucking sick and tired of that backpacker, let me tell you. Uh, um, it doesn't have to be like that, but... All they have to do is just make it feel new. And I think you just accomplish that with just having entirely new Pokemon. I don't know it's why it's not something they ever do. And that's why I always uh, limit myself to only new Pokemon whenever a new generation comes out. Because it's more, I don't know, I mm. just find it more fun that way. I get excited, oh, I get excited over all these new Pokemon that there are available. 
I try to limit my I try to limit myself to Pokemon I have never used before. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ, yeah, Geosphere. I mean, I get like, that. When I through, like when I played through <laughs> X and Y, I'd never used a with the exception of Lapras, uh, which I I kind of used once before. Uh, I had never used like Kangaskhan, but I used them for that playthrough because like I just never got a chance to really use one before. Yeah, but um, see now here's the deal with that for me, right? Um, like you use Lediba in uh, Sun and Moon, and I know that was mostly because I fucking aid you on, but like that's what you use, you use Lediba. Um, like how many times? No, I use Cutie Fly. What's up? I, I said I I I did use one, but I didn't get. I I I, yeah. I guess I used one. You used them, yes. What else did I use? I used. I guess. Uh, anyhow, like you, you've seen, you've seen a uh, like, like you've seen Ladybug before and stuff like that. That like you, you so you kind of like are familiar with how Ladybug are and stuff like that. And that plays like every old bug Pokemon. How cool would it be to just have like three new bug Pokemon to like freaking obsess over? Do I even have strength? I, mean, I knew what. Well, I so if, for that playthrough, um. That was the first time I'd used Ladian in at like at all in the Pokemon game. Oh, I so. know it was the first time, but like you've encountered Ladybug before, I'm sure. I have no idea what strength what it, is. Yeah, I knew what it is. I know what like I knew what it is. I knew I knew what all its I knew all its base all its base stats before yeah, before I even caught it. Not even like base um, stats, but like its play style and stuff too. You kind of just are familiar with. Yeah. I feel like that ruins kind of the fun with it, you know. Not really. I'm gonna learn it real quick, anyways. Yeah, but it's like familiar. So instead of it being like this thing that you like grow accustomed to over time and learn to use to its fullest extent, it's like, oh, I already know how this does and how all this works well, and like, stuff like this. It's, it's well, for the most. I mean, to be fair, like also most of the. It's early, like most of the early game Pokemon are all gonna be like that. They're all gonna be like. It's like use. It's the difference between like like Furret and um, uh, Linoon. There's not much. There is a little difference. Um, mainly for me, what I mean, yeah, they're kind of similar. But here's the problem. I kind I kind of not sure what Linoon does besides pick up. I can't. I think I guess Furret has pick up too. But um, I don't know. Mm -hmm. My run through of Soul Silver with Furret was uh really awesome um oh shit i just realized they both, have, they both someone said oh i knew is objectively have, the uh, best for uh, uh no zigzag goon is the best first route normal pokemon right uh mm -hmm. what did you say what's up i was gonna say like they like their attack they they're even even a lot of their moves are the same too yeah they're pretty similar because it's the first route normal one uh, they didn't start changing up, like, the bird Pokemon or anything until, uh, actually, after Gen 5, really, where they started well, making them quite different. I mean, uh, Bibarel is pretty different in Sinnoh, um, as a normal water-type Pokemon. Yeah. Um, although they went back to it with, uh, whatever. But, uh, you know, like, they didn't, they didn't do any change-ups with that kind of Pokemon, which is a bit disappointing, but, you know, the... A lot of Pokemon are pretty different. They have some that are sort of familiar and sort of grounded, especially in the Gen 5 game, but they're also quite different, and they do different things. Like, freaking uh, Talonflame had Gale Wings, which was a completely new ability, which gave uh, Flying-types priority move. That was, w it was wicked broken, but, uh, you know, mm -hmm. it was really cool. Uh, I forgot what I was doing. How did I end up here? When did I get here? Okay. Uh, I gotta look up where we get strength. Also, I might call it here because I want to sleep. Um, only because it has yeah, to do that. Fair. But anyhow, I guess we'll talk about the objective best first route normal type Pokemon next time on Svelton's. I'll have to put it down on the list for me. Um, Because that, that's a... That's a good discussion. Mm -hmm.
Um, but next time on Skeletons, I'll I figured out what strength is, and maybe we can progress. Uh, bye bye.